cross-platform mobile apps have become very popular in today's era. And with the advent of frameworks, it is now quite easier to build native apps without Swift for iOS or Java for Android. You might have heard a lot about the two most popular cross-platform mobile frameworks, React Native and Flutter that are being used to build thousands of mobile apps today. If you are not sure which one would be an ideal choice, React Native or Flutter, for building a successful mobile application, we are here to help you understand the differences between the two and which works best for your project. Both React Native and Flutter are powerful technology frameworks with their own set of pros and cons. React Native and Flutter come with a lot of similarities like building cross-platform apps using one code base, hot reloading, excellent UI, awesome tooling and native features. But they do have their differences. Let's explore the differences between them based on several factors. The first factor is language. React Native. React Native is written entirely in JavaScript using React and finding developers to code in JavaScript is simple. Hence, gaining expertise on React Native is quite easy for any JavaScript developer. Flutter. Flutter is written in a language called Dart, which is a relatively newer language. Learning Dart can be a daunting task for beginners as there are minimal courses or books available online for the Dart programming language. Second one is user experience. React Native is highly popular for providing the best user experience. It provides user interface, kits and valuable components like scroll view fixed header, pagination components, activity indicators and snap carousals that enhance the user experience across multi-platform. On the other hand, Flutter also has elements, tools, customized widgets and layered architecture to offer a rich user experience. But when it comes to user experience comparison, Flutter has always been given the first preference because it required less code. Third one is user interface. React Native makes the use of native user interface UI, components that allow you to build your UI with isolated components or libraries. Flutter contains a set of proprietary widgets for each platform. Android and iOS platforms are designed to work with their specific text field widgets and Flutter does not use platform APIs. Flutter offer you a larger set of user interfaces that could make you choose it over React Native. Next one is development time. React Native is highly preferred by the developers as it requires less time for project development. But the Flutter development process takes more time than React Native. It takes some time to create the necessary tools, expand functionality and develop the community. And the last one is reusable code. Flutter allows developers to easily rewrite pieces of code that needs to be fixed to fit on the platform, making code reuse more effectively. React Native also allows code reuse but with limitations. Only a few major components can be reused across platforms, while the rest must be written separately for each platform. So Flutter wins here again. To wrap up, React Native is a perfect framework if you would like to build native and cross-platform applications. But if your application requires multiple iterations or if you are planning to build a minimum viable product, then Flutter is a great choice. Do you want to create high quality and robust applications for the Android and iOS operating systems? Contact Forcebolt, the world's preferred React Native app development company for your application development project and our certified mobile application developers will help you build the perfect application for your business.